So yeah, before we start, I'm just going to say sorry to any girl on my fan base for this. But yeah. Today we're going to talk about oversexualizing of women on uh, basically like video games and the internet in general. Because we all know that stuff is happening. And before you ask, yes, that is Doll Dummy as a woman and Doll Dummy right next to her. Her, I guess. I didn't even know what the hell to draw about this, like seriously. Try to not make it offensive. Anyway... So I was basically like looking at stuff, like I, I always look at like... I always play different games and I look at other games on ads. And every single time you look in the corner of like YouTube or any other site, you always see like those ads with that big busted woman basically just standing there. With like, like basically like, oh, play this game! I'm so beautiful, why would you play this game with me? Now I'm just like, what the fuck is this game? Uh, and, uh, like, yeah, basically that's how me and my friend found Pangya, so. <laughs> uh, fucking hell. Anyway, like, the first, like, game, like, the Pangya is actually one of those over-sexualized games, I'm going to be honest. I really like the game, though, because, well, it's golf. It basically is golf with friends, and... And I never actually played golf, like I played a lot of golf, but I want to play with friends and then I was just looking for online golf game and Pangya was kind of like a, what's it called, a game where basically like you play golf. But here's the thing, the best character for me is actually a woman with like a girl, like a te like it kind of looks like a teenager kind of girl. She basically has white hair, like, I, I basically, here she has blonde hair and basically, but she, I changed the costume of her. And, uh, yeah, every single time I get a birdie or even a hole in one or maybe even a, an eagle, basically every single time I get a panty shot and I don't really, like, want to, like, I just, like, what the fuck? Uh -oh. Like, it makes me don't want to get, like, like, I am a man, and so a part of me likes it. A part of me thinks that it's really creepy, though. Like, a part of me basically, like, says, like, oh, like, yeah. And some part of me is like, no, 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 inappropriate, no. And uh, I think that's what every male, though. Like, every male would just say, like, yeah, uh, pretty weird, but at the same time, I kind of like it. At the same time, I really hate it, like... Any red blood male will say the same thing. And, uh, like, when it comes to this shit, uh, when it comes to this, it's kinda like... You don't want to choose a game over, like, sexual sexuality, basically, like... I basically looked at a bunch of, like, like, ad games. Some MMOs are a little bit weirder than the others, and after watching, like, uh, you know... I'm gonna call it, like, Dead Bones and Bruce Willikers on uh, YouTube for playing, uh, playing it for the plot, which is, like, the new series they're making, and I really like that, like, series, because they actually are playing, like, games that are advertised in the corner with, uh, and plays it together, which is basically, like, a bunch of MMOs and has, like, a, what's it called, a way to basically, like, like, click it, and it just shows that. Like, for example, there was this game, like, they were playing, like, the most worst one at the start, though. Like, that one was just bad. If you want to see it, then I will put it in the description, I bet, so... If you want to see it, then, sure. Here, there we go, in the description. And, uh, like, ugh, whenever I play games that are, like, a little bit sexualized, or a lot of sexualized, like, I think everybody, every game has that now, like, one girl that is really, like, busty, or even, like, horribly, like, designed with a big booty. Like, for example, Chica, though. Like, Chica. Though Chica mostly creeped me out. Nothing about that was like, oh, yeah. It was just like, oh, God! <laughs> Sorry for the loud. But, yeah, it was, like, really bad, if you ask me. And, uh, I kinda get why people do it though, because, like, they are targeting the male of this market, of course. Though, like, seriously, why is there no, like, 
male kind of like I'm not saying that because like I'm just saying that because like uh, I wonder why is there no like since there since for women nowadays it's starting to be, get popular with like doing uh, a lot of not drawings but uh, basically like basically looking at uh, basically a lot of women basically play a lot of games nowadays like uh, males play games a lot too like still they are I think they're a majority so I guess get that but like the women is starting to basically come up and basically like play a lot but I think like the uh, women that's a little bit like a sexual de attention like they don't really care if uh, basically the guy who is in front of the cover of the next thing is basically a big dick man, I don't know. And uh, for like, but for male, it's just like yeah, like they think we basically love big breasted woman, and honestly, a part of me likes it because well, I'm male, I'm a man, I can actually say I like it a little bit. But part of me is just like, no, I'm not going to play this, and that part always succeeds. I never play like MMOs that I see that are like really sexualized. I play like one, like the one with golf, because I want to play golf. Like, and it's a fun game, I must admit. Panya is a fun game, but it's kind of sexualized, and the best character for me is kind of a girl. So, yeah. It's like it's halfway there. There's like this really like awkward thing talking about this by the way, which is why I'm a little bit silent at the moment. Like I'm also looking at the picture at the same time, it's not helping me! Damn it! And uh like for just saying this though. Like over like the basically the the thing is, a reason why they do it a lot, I would like, I would actually say it's because like people want to see that. People don't want to see like a normal person, they want to see a fancy person. Like the same with male too, like a, ma a man always is like, yeah, big and strong, thin, there's never a character that are like fat or obnoxious, like it's always just like this, or like there is an ob obnoxious character. But it's always these like really badass looking characters, no problems, huge guns, and uh, like, or a gigantic sword, or anything. And for females, just like, yeah, big breasts, huge ass, and uh, that is basically like how they do it. And honestly, I don't blame them. Because, well, it does really look weird. It basically also helps people like pick uh, like uh, stuff on this. Like I'm going to be honest, if this video gets a lot of more, a lot more views than than the other views, because I have this doll dummy slash girl on it, I'm going to see like if this is going to get a little bit more views than the others, I will know for sure because. Thumbnails are a lot of like the problem with this bit. A lot of people seem to like that, like to basically have like a big breasted woman on in front of their like co cover or like on the thumbnail to basically get people to get there. Like for example, uh, like uh, the guy who basically talks about Tumblr. The guy who basically talks about Facebook. Like all of them had like a really like. Yeah, they're like a really just like that it just it was a woman in front of it like on the thumbnail nothing the woman was never appearing in the entire video why well no reason why should it be no it's in the thumbnail why should it be like I personally get a little bit mad whenever I see that like whenever I s well I don't get mad because I well every single time I see like somebody just like oh yeah I have a like I have like something here and like if there's a character in there that looks like that and uh, then I can get it like if you're playing a game like for example uh, to Tomb Raider and uh, Laura Croft is on the your thumbnail but I really like fan art of it like she is big breasted and such 
then I get it, because then it's Laura Croft, of course. But if it's just like... For example, this. If I was just like talking about, for example, uh, if I'm talking about like cats on uh, on YouTube or like making a dr speed draw of a cat, I will make a thumbnail of a cat, not a big-breasted woman as a cat, like in a cat costume. Like so that would be really disorientated. But yeah, I like I kind of get like so some of it why people do it because they want lots of views, like. They want to be popular, and the way to get popular is basically getting noticed by people who who wants to go there for some reason. And basically, being being uh, random, and or maybe have like a picture of a woman will actually prove it that you actually are going to get a lot of views. So my. Like I'm, I passed the mark, and I'm going to stop here because I, I'm not that familiar with the subject here. But uh, let's just see if this video is good. If this video gets a lot of views, we will see. Like if, like if this gets a lot of views, then we know that uh, the picture I drew right here will actually tempt people. I really hope that it doesn't though. Like at the same time, it's. It's cool to get a lot of views, but I don't want people to get go there just because there's some random ass like stuff that basically tempts people to get there. Anyway, that was uh, this was uh, Doldum here, and we'll talk to you later, guys. And uh, thurs like Thursday will be another day for Pokemon, so stay tuned, and uh, maybe you will get your own Pokemon tomorrow. Who knows? You will know. Goodbye.